Hey you guys! I just got home. Before I left this morning, when I was walking out the door, there was a mailman with all my beautiful packages and they're all books. Uh, I got my book out order from the sale. I got the one I placed like a day before the sale and then I got something from Amazon. So I'm, I'm just gonna um, unbox this for you guys real quick. This is part one of my June book haul I guess since June isn't over yet I still might buy a few Kindle or Audible books so I'll just put those and all the other books that I got on their own so and plus hey you never know I might place another order of books before then so uh, those will just be in a separate order so let's go ahead and get started we can start on the one from Amazon I actually already started the series and book two of the series is in my book outlet order so hopefully they all have the same covers because that was one thing I was worried about so I just went with the picture showed me so yeah hold on here we go what I got is Saints Blood by Sebastian de Castell this is book three and then I got Traitor's Blade, which is book one, and they look like this. And this is part of the Great Coat series, and there's four. Uh, so all of them are out because the last one just came out this year. I read this one, and I'm reading the second one right now because I own the first three on my Kindle. So I'm so I decided to go ahead and buy the physical books because I do. I was already loving them so far, and yes, yeah, so I got these two from Amazon, and yeah i'm really looking forward to seeing what's next so yeah like that is rambling come on keisha get with the program now this book outlet haul i really wanted to get these books and i knew they weren't going to make it for the sale for those of you who don't know book outlet had a 15 percent off sale uh so um i was just like I have I wasn't sure if I was gonna make an order but I definitely wanted these books before then okay who are we kidding I woke up early I had books in my cart I was definitely gonna make an order I was hoping that these would last into the sale but they didn't but there's something I really wanted and it was cheaper to get them here than on Amazon so the first book would be Every Heart Adore by Sean McGuire. I'm so looking forward to this book. The first two are out and the third one is coming out um, December. The second one actually just came out. But this one follows these people, like all these like kids who are left behind. Like, you know, people who went into other like Narnia or like say they went into like other like fantasy realms and then they like were kicked out of that realm and then they go to like this halfway house for other people who have to live in this world and I'm really looking forward to it because I've heard of like a lot of good things I think only a few people I know were like it's not worth the hype but it sounds really good so I'm really looking forward to this and then I got <laughs> Siege and Storm and Ruin and Rising by Lee Bardugo so if you guys saw my last book haul you guys know I got Six of Crows duology and I own the first one in this series but I didn't own the second one and the third one so I'm really looking forward to maybe rereading the first one and then reading these two and then getting to the Six of Crows duology so I'm really excited about that and I was just seeing if I have bookmark or anything nope and then last but not least the biggest box that I have I'm really looking forward to this uh, so Oh, I got like a lot of books but for a low price so I'm really looking forward to this this is gonna be a lot so there's gonna be a lot of sequels so the first thing I got is the Red Queen by Christina Henry this is the second book in the Alice series this is a twisted version of what happens to Alice so I'm really looking forward to reading it uh, I haven't read the first book yet but I recently like read Alice in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll like not like a disney fied version but like the original version and then the sequel so I'm really looking forward to reading some retellings. And then I have um, A Gathering of Shadows by V.E. Schwab. I haven't read the first one yet but I heard really great things so I decided just to pick it up since it was on sale at that point and I'm trying to I'm probably gonna read some of her books during one of these months. And then 
I got Dangerous Creatures and Dangerous Deception by Cami Garcia and Margaret Stuhl. I really enjoyed the first book in the Beautiful Creature series, so I just went ahead and bought these there since they were cheaper on Big Outlet. Plus, my aunt recently read the other four, so I'm probably going to give her these because she would be really interested in reading these next ones, I'm sure. And then I got uh, the Bane Chronicles by Cassandra Clare, Sarah Reese Brennan, and Maureen Johnson. Now you guys know I have put a stop to buying Cassandra Clare books, but recently me and Christina from The Princess Gunny Bear have been reading the books. Technically we've only read City of Bones and City of Ashes so far, but we're probably going to read City of Glass really soon. And although we won't get to this one for quite a while, at least I'll have it like in my repertoire and I might as well get it now since I was placing an order now. And then... Oh, it's so beautiful. I got The Hobbit by J.R.O. Tolkien. I wanted all the books in this um, edition, but you know, it's really hard to find them, a number one. But also, I didn't have a good copy of The Hobbit. Like, the last time I bought one, it was horrible. So I decided to go ahead and get it, and I'm really looking forward to rereading The Hobbit. So, oh, I'm really looking forward to this. It is so beautiful, you guys. And then, I got the second book in the Great Coat series, book two. Yes, all the covers match. I would have got them all on here, but they didn't have it. And they did have this one by the same people who sold the other one on Amazon, but they were showing a different cover, and I needed to make sure that all my covers match. Although I like the other ones too, they're just like white on the background instead of brown, and these colors pop a lot more. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. And then I got Seven Wonders Journals, The Promise, an original novella by Peter Lestrange. Lestrange. I oh, I read the first book, Love, and I own the whole series, and I have these little novellas, and this is the final one that I needed. So now I'm going to marathon the series, which has just been a goal of mine. And then I got The Jungle Book by uh, Rupert Kipling, but this is illustrated by Manang, or whatever. This is part of the interactive elements edition, so I definitely need to go and do like uh, like a flip through of this book but they also have a Beauty and the Beast and Peter Pan edition they didn't have those on there and they're kind of expensive so of course I wanted to get this one from here and then I'll probably just splurge and buy the other two sometime soon I'm really excited to like have this edition like I've seen the Peter Pan one it looks amazing and then because I'm gonna say and then a lot I got Bright Smoke Cold Fire by Rosamund Hodge. I love Cruel Beauty. I haven't read Crimson Bound yet, but I'm really looking forward to this, and I'm really looking forward to this one. War is coming, death is coming, one city is left, only the Juliet holds the key to save it. So, you know, I love Romeo and Juliet, and every telling is always welcome. And then I got, uh, last but not least, The Gospel of Loki by Joanna M. Harris. I actually own the physical copy of this book, um, but I decided to go ahead after listening to like a sample to get the auto copy and I decided to get it on here instead of like on audible that way I could listen to it in the car so yeah those are all the books that I got Ooh, there was a lot of packaging down at the bottom so you guys let me know if you guys gave into the book outlet sale if you guys have read any of these books or which ones you guys think I should read next and I will talk to you guys later so, bye